He goes by Grandmaster Jay. And Grandmaster Jay, the leader, Grandmaster Jay. Johnson brought the NFAC to Louisville twice at the height of the protest over Breonna Taylor's death. He's facing federal charges, accused of pointing an assault weapon at police back in September. Y'all know what our rules of engagement are, right? We don't point our weapons at nobody. Unless they point them at you. NFAC leader John Johnson, known as Grandmaster Jay, is now in the Oldham County Jail on federal charges. Court documents provide these two photos from September, the day before the derby at Jefferson Square Park. Police say it shows Johnson holding an assault rifle pointed towards law enforcement officers on the roof above him. To use this and to make this move speaks of ridiculous, racist, unfair policing structure in this city. Grandmaster Jay is a national figure, so this once again makes Louisville look like the, the hot spot of racism. And all y'all thought we were going to show up with torches and burn the joint down. That was figurative. It meant that we would burn down something, and we burned down the walls. Grandmaster Jay is still in custody. Grandmaster Jay is still in custody. For the first time, a Louisville police officer has been found criminally responsible in the killing of Breonna Taylor. Former Detective Kelly Goodlett pleaded guilty to a charge of conspiracy yesterday in federal court. She admitted conspiring, conspiring with another officer to falsify the search warrant used in the raid that led to Taylor's death. The 26-year-old EMT was shot in March of 2020 after police burst into the apartment where she was sleeping. Goodlett resigned earlier this month after the Justice Department announced new charges against her and three other officers. The others are accused of civil rights violations, conspiracy, obstruction, and use of excessive force. Why do you think it's necessary to carry weapons? I'm not going to answer that question unless you ask that question of every other race that carries weapons, every other civilization that has gone into other countries with weapons. The police carry weapons. Weapons were invented to defend oneself. So it is only common sense that we carry weapons to defend ourselves. It is not a question. It is a necessity. How would you describe the state of race relations in America right now? Pathetic. There's no other word. It's pathetic. We know you got troops, so go ahead and send them. After the rain, we gotta change, we cannot do it the same. Better say his name, G.M.J. But you gon' drink this rain.